Okay, uh, let's look at uh, 5.3, number 3. All right, so here I'm going to use the formal substitution to uh, evaluate this integral. All right, so uh, I'm going to let right, u to b. Right, so usually if you have square root or parentheses, and uh, the inside expression is going to be the sub uh, uh, the choice of u. So in this case, u is going to be that guy. So four minus uh, five x squared. Right. Then in your mind, you can kind of do a mental calculation. Derivative of this is negative ten x which is sitting right here. So this is probably the right choice, right? So we take the derivative of u with respect to x, which is equal to negative 10 x, right? So I'm going to solve for uh, dx. So uh, I'm going to take the reciprocal of both sides to get the dx over du. And reciprocal of uh, negative 10x is 1 over negative 10x. Right? Then we can just uh, mult uh, multiply both sides by du to isolate dx. So dx is going to be equal to du over negative 10x. All right, so we can rewrite this uh, integral as, um, I'm going to probably go here, so I'm going to go here, right, as this. So you have an integral, right, it's a cube root of u, so you have a cube root of u, right, then I'll, I'll leave uh, negative 10x as it is for now. Right, but you can see that the dx is du over negative 10x. Right, so you can cancel 10x and 10x. And also, I don't like uh, cube roots, so I'm going to rewrite it as u to the right cube root is same thing as one th uh, one third power and the du, right? Then uh, we can just use the uh, simple power rule to find the antiderivative. So we add one to the power, which is going to be four thirds, right? And divide by four thirds is same as multiply by three quarters. So I'm gonna put three quarter in front. Then you have uh, plus some constant c. All right, then we can put the original uh, expression back in. So u is 4 minus uh, 5x squared. So we put that back in. So we have 3 over 4. Then quantity, you have 4 minus 5x squared. Raise it to the 4 thirds power plus c. Right, so that's the answer. Right, and the second part is to verify that the, this is the the right solution. So we're gonna take the derivative of this, see if you can get uh, this expression back. Right, so let's take the derivative. So we are taking a derivative of. So we are ch checking. All right, derivative of uh, three quarters quantity four minus five x squared to the four thirds power plus c. All right, so this is just a derivative. So let's see, you have uh, three quarters. It's just a constant, so put it there, All right? Then general power rule. So put the uh, power in front, so four thirds. 
keep the same quantity 4 minus 5x squared and I subtract 1 from the power so it's going to be a 1 third power then multiply by derivative of what's inside so it's derivative of 4 is 0 derivative of negative 5x squared is negative 10x right then of course derivative of a constant is 0 so we don't we're not going to write anything down right then we can we can just clean up so you can see that the 4 on top 4 on the bottom cancel out 3 on top 3 on the bottom cancel out so what you get is right so one third power is a cube root right cube root of 4 minus 5x squared times negative 10x right so you can see that uh, this is exactly the same as the integrand of the integral right here so this checks that we have the right antiderivative. All right, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.